Listen to what the Bible says here. i got to find it in Romans uh, 14, verse number 17. The kingdom of God is not meat and drink, but righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. That's what the kingdom of God is. It's, it's uh, righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. Let's turn to Psalms 23. David wrote another verse here, and you know Psalms 23, the whole psalm we can read, but verse number 6, David said, Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. You know what David, I think what David's saying here is, it's the best life. It's the Christian life is the best life. Christ in you. The Holy Ghost in you. The love of God you have because you're saved. Your sins forgiven. Heaven is your home. Is priceless. The best life here. Uh, goodness and mercy shall follow me. And then it's the best life to come. I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Sometimes uh, Christians need to win. If you're born again... You need to get the Bible and really, really, really let God speak to your heart of the reality of a home in heaven. That's right. It is as real as here. It's, it's a scary thing to, to think that perhaps you'd have a home waiting you and not know. Because if you don't know, you probably don't. That's a frightful thing. It's a frightful thing to not know uh, that you're saved. The Bible says, These things have I written unto you that believe in the name of the Son of God, that you might know that you have eternal life, and that uh, you might... Uh, and, and after that, I forget what it says. After that, but it says you should know that you have eternal life. You need to know that heaven's your home. <laughs> I, I'm going to live here for that in which I will live forever. 